Hi, welcome to Bonnie's Fashion Buzz. I'm in Nantucket and we're expecting quite a bit of wind and rain. Seems like the hurricane or tropical storm is definitely working its way up to New England. I have my doors wide open and things are blowing, so I've had to button down the hatches today. But it's all about my golden rules to dress by. And I always like to say it's BLT, B, build your wardrobe with classic pieces, L, liven your wardrobe with fun novelty items, and T, tweak your wardrobe with touches of color. And that's exactly what I'm doing today. One of my most favorite colors on the planet is periwinkle blue. And so I'm using basic black right now. I have on a pair of black leggings, my little floaty skirt that I can have custom made in any size, any length. And it's so easy. It's, it's a washable silk jersey. And I've sold them by the hundreds in the last probably 30 years. They just never go out of style. And of course I have wonderful slacks. But the real punch piece of the collection are these fabulous silicone and chiffon scarves that I carry. I have shawls and tunics and ponchos, but today I'm featuring this beautiful scarf in periwinkle. They're all one of a kind. This happens to have gold and silver painted on it, and I love wearing it around my neck and tie, but a lot of my clients would maybe just have it loose because it has a body and a weight to it that really enables it to lay beautifully. And look how stunning that is. And then I also want to show you these wonderful earrings that I found. These are vintage earrings and they're clip-on. I can always have them converted into pierced if somebody loves them. But look how adorable they are and it's the exact color as the silk and the chiffon. So I thought that was fantastic. And then this is a ring that is absolutely a museum piece. It's an incredible Aurora Borealis crystal, beautiful cut, and it has a very unique look. I put it on the middle finger and it's got two stones that kind of really are just stunning with this beautiful periwinkle that I'm showing today. And then this is Italian glove leather. It's a bolero jacket that I had designed. It ends, it's all lined in this beautiful snakeskin silk. Look at even the detailings of the inside pocket if you want to hide your license or a little lipstick or hanky. And then I'll show you how adorable this is with the scarf. It's just almost exactly the same dye lot. Now I only have one of these jackets and this jacket happens to be a size six. It's a little, little skimpy on me, or it could even be a 4.6, I would say. But it's just adorable with this little floaty skirt and this scarf. And I'll turn around so you can see the back. So it really is shorter in the back and then kind of comes down a little longer in the front. And I just thought that was a great way to start. And I want to show you as simple as changing a pair of earrings look at these earrings these are also vintage with lapis and antique ivory so they're really quite old very old silver look at those so just even a simple change of the earring can change the whole look and i want to take this and show you that you can even keep it just loose it's got this great substance to it I mean, look at the design on that. I'm really spending a lot of time sharing this because I, I just think it's spectacular. And I'll step back again. Isn't that great? And of course I'm showing one of my two-tone belts that are all hand cast, gold and silver. Unbelievable. And then it has this gorgeous Italian glove leather contoured strap that really makes the waist look so slim and trim. And I do the actual straps made to order. So I have clients that will give me their waist size and we do it. So there's always an extra tail going down. And then I want to show you a few other things that I think 
would really put together a great weekend wardrobe. So the other color that I want to share with you is this as a white pop piece. I think that we could all, if I was telling you to pack for the weekend, I would say have a pair of black pants. Let me just show you what else I would show this with. This is another one of my silicone scarves. In this case, it's got little penguins and it's got white silicone on it. So I might wear a top like this. It's got window pane with a little bit of netting in here, a little window pane detail on the sleeve. It's really cute, even with a little floaty skirt, with a legging, and just to throw on a scarf like this would be great. And then in that case, I would probably end up changing these earrings and just go for these simple Chanel earrings. So, hi, Lisa. Hi, Albert. Great to have you here watching today. We're expecting a storm up here in New England. Hi, Rob. Wonderful to have you. Miss you all. Glad that you got, you got the, the storm actually passed over Florida. So, that was very nice to hear. Now, it's heading to us. Thank you very much. So, but anyway, there's a really cute little look. And then I would probably wear, but I didn't want to take the time. A pair of white jeans. See, always I would say if you're going away for the weekend, a black pair of leggings, a little black floaty skirt, a pair of white jeans, probably a little white flat. I don't sell shoes, but I certainly have a nice collection of them. And here we have to wear flats. But this is really cute. I like it even with the black bottom. But that's a great look with these Chanel-like little button earrings. And then I might wear this little Nantucket bag, which I had custom made. I have people that in Palm Beach have ordered it with different various sites of Palm Beach. Other people have sent me pictures of their kids, their dogs, their houses. Whatever pictures you have, I can make a custom bag. And they're all lined in silk. And look at how that pops with white or black, or this gorgeous kind of periwinkle blue. Isn't that a fun piece to pack along for the weekend? And so different. And then I would probably end up wanting to show, I'll take this off, and I'll take this off. So much fun showing all these mixes and matches. And I love the way this works. So I'm going to show this real quickly doing these quick changes and I think at this point I'm taking off the floaty skirt here we go and I'll take off even the belt I don't think I need the belt I'm showing this this is a patchwork little zippered shirt jacket it's almost like, I feel like it's almost like a piece of wearable art. It is. It's all hand-dyed fabric that's been sewn on almost like a little quilting method. Look at that with these great little white button earrings. Really pops with that. Look how cute. You could wear it open or closed. And look at this. This is the, the little penguin scarf again. And look at how this works with it. I mean, it's so fun because all these different people don't know one another. And I put it all together. They're all different artists that I represent for the last 30 years or so. Look at how pretty that is. And Joe Hale, I miss you. And I know we're in the same island, wherever you are. And Simi from LA, who I haven't seen in so many years, but we have Blanche in common. Wonderful to have you and sorry that you got your... Uh, your little accident with your foot. I hope you heal fast, Simon. It's great to have you. So, but anyway, I think that's kind of cute. And then uh, I would say that you could wear this, like I said, unzipped, opened up, loose like that. Again, with the white pants, it would be cute. And then I have this adorable necklace that's um, all lapis, sodalite, and it has a little Millie Fiore silver hand-blown beads. 
And I think something like that in a lariat could just be fun. And then in that case, I would change the earrings to these fabulous earrings that I have that are Millie Fiore also, oddly enough. I mean, how all this stuff works together is just unreal. And I feel like it really makes for a long weekend. Everybody's doing these little motor trips and they're, they're just needing about four or five different changes in a little bag. And I think that's cute. And again, remember, don't forget your trusty white jeans to pull the whole thing together so that you don't have to always wear it with black. But I think that's cute. If you feel it's a little, you want to go simp a little more simply, you can just wear the necklace, forget the scarf that day. That's terrific. And then to kind of top it off, the last thing I want to show you, I'm going to put on right over my leggings, a pair of blue jeans. I'm throwing these on. This is not easy, folks. I'm telling you, doing this live on air, it's hysterical. And then I would end up basically wearing this with a belt. I'm not going to take the time to put it through the pant loop, but I will hook the belt on. If I can. Always a challenge. Okay, there we go. And I'm going to stick the pockets in. So I've got on these great jeans, which everything goes with that. But look at this jacket. This is the cat's meow. It's all ecot, hand-dyed linen. Look at the colors on this. And it's got mother of pearl buttons. Beautiful mother of pearl buttons. And all the buttonholes are hand-stitched. I mean, you don't see workmanship like this. This is really a couture jacket. I only have one. I got enough fabric for one and I had a designer make this for me. It has cuffs. Look how cute that is with a blue jean. And all these things work great together. It looks great with this necklace with the lapis and sodalite and a little bit of the Millie Fury earring. That's adorable. You could wear it with a pair of blue jeans. You could wear it with your the black floaty skirt, you could, if you want to dress it up, and of course, the white jeans. So it just goes with everything, and it's so comfortable. And I'll turn around so you can see it. And I want you people to know in Nantucket that every Saturday I'm doing a showing at an adorable store at number three India Street called Recipsa. And this bag is from Recipsa, and all the pieces I just showed you can fit into here. You just roll them up. They don't wrinkle. They really, if you know how to just pack well, they all fit in here as your little weekend bag. You throw in your toiletries, the little flat shoes, a pair of sneaks, and a sandal, and you're set. And we are showing at Recipsa every Saturday in August. I'm so excited. And I'm there from 11 to 6. And, and these are their bags. So we really have a great kind of uh, camaraderie because they have all one-of-a-kind things too. And I will be back on Thursday. Let me see who else is watching. Ulya, oh, that's wonderful. I saw your paintings at Robert Foster. You did a great job this season. And it's just wonderful to have you all here. Um, so every Tuesday and Thursday on Facebook Live at 3 o'clock, rain or shine, I'm going to be here, and then I'll post it on YouTube. And I really particularly ask everybody to share me and to subscribe. And it seems to be really building. I'm doing a lot of FaceTime appointments, and people are coming here in town to see me socially distanced showings out on my deck and again thank you so much for taking the time this afternoon love you all miss you Mwah. feel good but look even better see you thursday